I need to fuck these guys up really badly, but is this the right time? Right up to the moment, Bolton's bastard. Hey everyone, my name is Mike and welcome back to part 4, I think it is, of Game of Thrones episode 3. In the last part we played as Garrod, Myra and Roderick. Playing as Roderick we decided to go and save Rickon, I think his name is, is it Rickon? The youngest brother in the family, who's been taken hostage by the White Hills. So we decided that we're, that's what we're going to do next with that family. And playing as Garrod, he got a new member of the Night's Watch joining him. And it turns out it's the guy who actually murdered his family, so... He's pretty pissed off with that, <laughs> as you can uh, imagine. And I'm playing as Myra, um, she had to sneak into Tyrion's room after he had been taken by the guards because they thought that he was the one who killed Joffrey. And um, she had to get the letter that he was about to send to her family to purchase the, um, the Ironwood. So let's jump into this and continue. Alright, this kind of looks like the Forester home. Okay, it's Rick. Yeah, it's... Um, Roderick, excuse me. We're not far now. Gwyn Whitehill may already be there. What is this? Our ironwood trees. It's the Whitehills. You see what they've done? You've taken the trees without permission. This track was hundreds of years old. And they reduced it to nothing. Before this is done, we'll make them pay. Every last one of them. I, the White Hills, need to answer for this. And Gwyn needs to answer for this. But we need to find out what she knows. She'll be over there. Be cautious, my lord. If she go around her father to help us, she must have some purpose. I'll hear what she has to say, but I won't forget who she is. Good. You see what her family's done here. Here. You might want this. You may have known each other since you were children, but this could be a trap. I'd take that, of course. Although she might be thinking the same thing. Doesn't hurt to be careful. Go on. I'll stay with the horses. I mean, as long as it's in his pocket, she'll never know that he's got it if he doesn't need it. So there's a wood cart we can lock at. No reason to, I don't think. We're just gonna... Oh, has he got in his hand? Okay. You can see right there it's in his hand. So it looks like she might get a bit startled if she sees him with a weapon. But I guess she can understand because that place has been trashed by the White Hills, it looks like. So, um... Is she hiding somewhere? Maybe she's hiding behind the cart, although we can't see her, but... Let's click on a few things. Split beams, cracked wheels, shoddy workmanship. Clearly white seal. Alright. So it looks like they've finished what they're doing here because there's no one left. You know, they, um, they've had this camp set up, it looks like, doesn't it? Where they've been chopping on the trees and cutting it all up and stuff. So I don't know where she is. I see you haven't lost your warrior's ways. That's good. I wouldn't want to deal with someone careless. Hello, Gwyn. Roderick. You saw my father's work over there, didn't you? There's no way to miss it. And he won't stop. He means to do that to every inch of your land. Soon, there will be nothing left to save. I hope you come with help, Gwyn. And I hope you'll listen to me. I come as a friend. <sighs> I wasn't sure you were even going to show. We're taking a risk, meeting like this. Unfortunately, it's the way it has to be. Thank you for paying respects to my father and brother. And for coming tonight. It's good to see you again. And you too, Roderick. I think we can help each other. But first, I... I've heard news of Asher. That he plans to return to Ironrath. Why is he coming back? I loved him once. I longed for Asher to come back. But not like this. Roderick, if you won't talk to me, then we risked meeting for nothing. 
I don't I don't trust her completely, so I don't want to tell her that he's bringing an army. That's why I stay quiet there. No more bloodshed. Is that what you want to? I need to hear you say it, Roderick. Will you work with me to bring an end to this war? Yes. Peace means my family will be safe. Of course that's what I want. The years have blessed you with wisdom, Roderick. And it is good you have it. Because peace is the only hope your family has. My father is just waiting for an excuse to attack. Why do you think he sent my brother? So there will be trouble. My father will bring utter ruin on your house. Unless... You let Griff feel like he's in control. I know you refuse to kiss my father's ring, but you would be wise to show more respect to Griff. I won't bend the knee or bite my tongue, not in my own house. Don't be a fool. There is so much more at stake here than just your pride. My lord, a band of riders approach from the north. Seven hells. My father's guards must be tracking me. If they catch us here, they'll kill you. A little bit outnumbered there, so... Then we've no time to waste. Let's get on with it. My father is planning to make a move against your family. I don't know all the details, but he's been sending a great deal of gold to someone in King's Landing. I fear for your family, Roderick. You may think you've nothing more to lose. He is ready to show you otherwise. What the hell is your father planning? I swear I don't know, but whatever it is, he knows all your weaknesses, all your plans. How? Because you have a traitor in your council. Someone who knows every detail of your circumstances. My father boasts of it. You must tell me. Who is it? I don't know. We know you're planning to rescue Ryan. Even if it means abandoning your home to Griff. What? Ryan, his name is not Rickon. <laughs> My father's guards are close. I need to know you'll do what I've asked. Promise me you'll submit to Griff. If you want peace between our families, it's the only way. There's no way I can make that promise. I could have helped you, but now... I won't be coming here again. Oh god. There's been enough killing. I hope you do your part. Um, I don't know, I just... The riders are nearly upon us. We have to go. What I told you. Be careful what you do with it. And remember, I'll hear about it if you don't. I'm very stubborn, you know, I'm not- I hate the- I hate Griff. I can't see myself bending the knee and obeying his Come words. On, I don't know. I know that's like, she thinks that's the best option, but- Oh my god, this is back home, is it? They've wrecked the place. Bastards. Fucking monsters, aren't they? Like, the forest, the house seems pretty peaceful. They've never, like... I don't know, it's just... It's all... I think it all started, really, because Garrett killed those guys. Mother. Roderick. Look at what's become of our house. You were nowhere to be found, and they just... Oh, they are vile men. Yep. Where were you? We need you here to hold this house together. Mother, I. I went to see Gwyn Whitehill. You did what? You would meet with the girl who once tore this house apart? Oh, I. I see now why you went in secret. Surely you must have known I would have counseled against it. I went only to hear what she had to say. It was my duty. She seems willing to help our family. That all depends on the help she offers. Well, what did she have to say? Lord Whitehill is plotting against us. I don't know his plans, but I fear them. And the only way he'll stop is if we submit to Griff's rule of our house. What? Would you really give up control of our house? No. Griff is already a torment. How much worse could it get? These are dire times, but I won't kneel to a whiter than my own house. Then don't kneel. Was this all? Did you learn anything more? 
You need to tell me. She's not the traitor. She's my mother. I can't see her being the traitor. My son. What I've told you is nothing compared to what else I've learned. So it's, it's worth telling her. There is a traitor in our house, on our council. No. This can't be. And all our plans to save Ryan, to save this house. All gone. Roderick, who could have turned on us? Times have been hard. But I never thought this would happen. Not in our house. I don't know. I have no idea. There's no way to be sure. If we don't know, then we can't trust anyone. Then again, I don't know why we should believe anything that girl told you. The White Hills would love to sow dissent in our house with lies of traitors. Get in there. Yeah, it's a bit of a... Go both ways, really. She could be lying. You know, who knows? What the fuck? Right, I'm gonna fuck these guys up now. I'm not bending the knee. I'm gonna tell them to get out my house. <laughs> what do you want from me? No, no, it was over there. And Ramsey was here. I'll play how I want. You will bend the, the knee. Reenacting. When Ramsey was here. True, I haven't the balls to defy you. Lord. Get out of my house now, all of you. Oh, look here! It's the new lord. You're in luck. We're just getting to the best part. <laughs> Little Lord Ethan's final breath. Unless you want to play the lord. I told her to stay out of sight. Instead, you can't do this. You can't do this. <laughs> we'll do as we please. Besides, we're not finished. You must stop. Oh, I know you've seen it before, but um, it gets better every time. Show some respect in my house, in my home. Well, that's what we're doing. Remembering young Ethan as he was. <laughs> oh, please, no! Say hello <laughs> to your father. Oh, no, Ethan! <laughs> <laughs> down. <laughs> oh, well done, well done. I'd say, I'd say, I'd say he died better than the real Ethan. Oh, yeah. <laughs> better than the real Ethan. What about you, eh? You want to be next? Men without honor are lower than dogs. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be happy to dirty my blade with your blood. You should have oh. seen it. Your brother. I need to yeah. fuck these guys up really badly, but is this the right time? Right up to the moment, Bolton's bastard put. No, I'm gonna show restraint. It's not the right time. Before I'm on my own. Over, I don't have a weapon. Will join my brothers on that floor. So I hope this was all worth it. It'll be worth it when I pull this blade from your neck and see the life drain out your eyes. Make his mother watch. No now we'll him. really have some fun. Enough. Griff will deal with him. When he's done, he'll own this fucking house. And he'll have more than just words for you. Take your boy out of here while you still can. Roderick. Roderick. Now is not the time. Yeah, I agree. It's not the time. I mean... I'm on my own. My mother's there. They could grab her if I hit him, you know, and it's just, there's too many things that can go wrong right then if I was to strike him. Jon Snow. Wendell, pack the extra, ra pack the extra rations. Duff, make sure the quivers of fortress are dry. Garrett. What's happening? We're heading north of the wall to deliver justice to brothers turned traitor. They're hiding in the woods at a place called Craster's Keep. I've been looking for volunteers. The cowards murdered Commander Mormon. We're going to kill every one of them. I'll volunteer to go. I thank you for that. I need every sword I can get. 
but Brit's going to. But the guy killed him. This dad, I mean. He's a brother now. It was quick. I understand why you hate him. But bad blood could jeopardize this mission. Too many unknowns out there. I can't have my own men killing each other. I'll go in his place. I'm a better fighter than Brit. You'll want my sword before his. I don't doubt your skill. But I need every sword that's willing to go. Even someone like Brit. If you do come, I need to know there won't be any trouble. Even if he provokes you. Can I count on you? I need your word, Garrett. I'll be taking a chance. The mission can't fail. I understand. You won't have any trouble from me. I'll hold you to that. It's a hard road to Crestus. We leave tomorrow at first light. Now why don't you go talk to those two? They volunteered as well. Make sure they're ready. Dorf! Where are my arrows? Well, what did Jon Snow say? I don't think he likes us much. Definitely doesn't like you, Finn. Haven't heard him singing your praises, have you? He wants us ready for the march tomorrow. Just give the word. I'm tired of being under Frostfinger's boot all the time. You do know we're heading off to fight a band of murderers, right? That's why you bring a ranger. Point is, he doesn't want any problems with you going to Craster's. Well, there's something you should know then. <laughs> I, uh, <laughs> borrow this from you. Oh, me? What? I thought you were going to give him the dagger. I wanted to know why your uncle was here. It never ends with you. I didn't mean no harm, honest. I just wanted a quick look. I wasn't stealing. Always planned on giving it back. You can't keep doing that, Cotter. Next time, ask. Well, I did try. And you, you just said your uncle was here about Ironwood. But I think it was something else. I noticed this part here. North Grove. That's just some shit story for little kids. A rumor. No, it's not. Of course it is. I had it to witch's den where they turned children into giants. Garrett, you don't actually take it seriously, do you? It's a fairy tale. For idiots. Everyone knows that. Didn't think you were that gullible. You're wrong, Finn. It's more than a rumor. Lord Forrester found the truth. It's real. And this says it's somewhere in the north. On the other side of the wall. And here I thought you might have some brains, Garrett. You two deserve each other. Have fun chasing your tails. Good. Didn't need him anyway. What do you mean? Finn doesn't know about the mammoths. Or white walkers. Or how to sneak past a giant. What, and you do? But you know, it's the things you hear about. The rumors is all. I wouldn't know myself. <laughs> How could I? Rumors my ass. You're hiding something, Cotter. Has he been off of the wall before? They're just things I hear around Castle Black's all. People talk, you know. Not about the North Grove they don't. You do? Probably heard you talking about it. Or, or maybe one of the recruits. Cotter, I know you're lying. I covered for you. You owe me. All right. All right. Here we go. What does he know? What's, what's, he, what's his past? I've been on the other side of the wall. Yeah, Garrett. that's what I thought he had. You see, I, I live there. In the north. I'm part of the free folk. People round here call wildlings. I know, I know, it's crazy. I, I was with some other free folk. We were looking for weapons south of the wall. We got caught, so, so I passed myself off as a local, and well, well, they sentenced me here to Castle Black. So they don't do any background checks, do I they? Here. <laughs> this isn't my place. I didn't know what else to do. Are you putting me on, Cotter? I wouldn't joke about that. They'd kill me if they found out. Are we... Are we still friends? I mean, 
Um, I know it's a lot to take in, and I'd understand if you were angry. Don't worry. Bloodthirsty wildling or not, we're still brothers. That is good to hear. <laughs> At least when Mance Raider wants to boil you alive, you'll know someone in high places. <laughs> what did I say? That shit house you fixed is still leaking. I'll be right there. I'm going back home. No matter what, Garrett. Oh, shit. I've heard stories. Old tales of a secret forest within a forest. Your lord knew what he was talking about. You know where the North Grove is? No. But I'll help you find it. I'm deserting anyway. Heading back home. I can guide you. Keep you alive. Stick with me and I'll show you the way. Plenty of things out there when I kill you. Others want to eat you. All right. Oh, I kind of like this like, guy's thinking, really. I don't know. He seems all right, but he's a wildling, so I don't know. I'm a little bit on the fence, really. Tell anyone about me. The watch should kill me if they found out. I mean, because we were thinking about deserting anyway to go look for the North Grove once we go north of the wall. So we may as well do it with someone who knows the lands. We just don't know if we can trust him completely and he doesn't bring any kind of ambush in, you know, wouldn't take us hostage. We just, I don't know. Do we want to desert? I want to know what the, I want to know what the North Grove is. All right, guys, we're going to end the video here as we transition to the next scene. It looks like we're playing as Asher again in the next, um, next scene. So we'll start that um, when we start the next video. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.